will be mostly clear, but some low clouds late tonight through mid-morning tomorrow. Light winds, lows in the upper 50s, high tomorrow in the mid-70s. And now this. At the Roswell Hair Growth Laboratories, we have perfected a simple surgical procedure to restore full hair growth virtually overnight. After my Roswell Hair Growth treatment, I bought the company. Hi. What's wrong? Nothing. Come on in. More wine? Are you worried about your hair thinning? No, of course not. I think you look very distinguished. You're very handsome. You don't like it, do you? I like you. Eat. It smells delicious, you know. So, you think I'm going bald? Don't. What's the big deal if you are anyway? Oh, so now I am going bald. It really doesn't matter to me. Are you telling me that you don't like hair? Of course I like hair. Then how can you stand looking at me? I mean, look at this. Look at that, huh? <laughs> Richard, you're behaving like a, a baby. Well, why not? I got hair like a baby. for you with my hairdresser. Dennis will give your hair a nice shape. I don't need shape. I need quantity. I need volume. I need more hair. Now, what about this? Huh? Forget it. Wait, no wait, wait, way. Wait, wait. No way. Hey, hey, come on. Just give it a chance. Take a look at it. I mean... That looks ridiculous. It won't fool anybody. Be careful with that. Richard. Well, you see, yeah. I don't think he'd ever know it was a uh, hairpiece. If you no, just take no. a little bit, no. Oh. Huh? Hey, no. Hey, wait a minute. What do you gotta mean? go. Hey, come on, man. I need that. I need that Richard, bag. you're in denial. What? It makes you look like the world's biggest jerk. It makes me look like it's I've got, got more hair. Rich I need that back. Fine. Let me just tell you how things are, okay, Richard? You're headed for Egg City, located in the Chrome Dome County, in the state of the cue ball. Do you understand what I'm talking about? In a year, your head will look like a Christmas tree lot in January. I understand that. That's why I need your help. Have you got some kind of a thickening agent? Something no, I can nothing. put in there and give it a little bit more, you know, volume, huh? But I can help you, Richard. Yeah. Let me. Of course. Okay. Now, what I can do, I can cut your hair. Mm -hmm. I can give it shape. I can give it style, Richard. Come on. Now, I can empower you, Richard. Give you back your man. I can't let you cut it's my hair. It's your birthright. You, okay, okay, what are you going to cut? Please, please. Let me just style it a little bit. What I do is, see, I start from, we start from no, here. No, no cutting, no cutting. Fine. Yes, styling. Most 
just the other day It's getting kind of long I could have said it was in my way Hi. I really like your hair like that. It looks nice. How about a drink? Did Dennis do that? Do what? Paint your head. Who painted your head? It doesn't work. Dennis didn't do that, did he? Tell me he didn't do that. No, I did it. You don't like it, do you? Poor baby. All oh, this is really getting to you, isn't it? No, it's driving me crazy, Megan. I can't eat, I can't sleep. Only thing I think about is my hair. I'm losing my hair. Oh, darling. It wouldn't be so bad. <laughs> what? <laughs> You've got stuff all over your face. Oh. <laughs> Look at all this crap. I disgust you, don't I? What disgusts me, Richard, is your inability to accept yourself as you are. I just don't want to be a bald guy. You're not a bald guy. You, you're, just, you're just a thinning hair guy. It means the same thing. It doesn't mean the same thing, okay? What it... I just can't deal with you when you're like this, okay? Megan. Oh. Megan. Megan, please. I think we need to spend some time away from each other. Oh, sure. Just walk out on the bald guy. Do yourself a favor, Richard. Wash your head. Miracle Shine, the miracle shampoo. Miracle Shine will add new fullness and life to your hair. That youthful luster is what all other shampoo products have claimed to achieve but never really delivered. Miracle Shine, the miracle shampoo, and... With Colossal Grow, your lawn will never be thicker. Professional gardeners are buying Colossal Growth and doubling... The, the Roswell Hair Growth Laboratory's patented technique is guaranteed. No painful and iffy transplants, no silly toupees or weaves, just a full head of beautiful living hair. Call now for an immediate appointment. Operators are standing by 24 hours a day. Remember, after my Roswell hair growth procedure, I bought the company. Hey, 
Yes? Mr. Richard Coberts is here for his appointment. Show him in, please. Nice to meet you, Richard. Doctor. Mr. Coberts is before picture. Have a seat, please. I take it my nurse has fully explained our procedure. Uh, yes, I saw your commercial on television. How does it work? We revive dead hair follicles by applying a protein-based solution to the hair roots beneath the scalp. What's in the protein solution? That's patent. <gasps> I love it when he talks that way. Don't you think you'll look just too sexy with a full head of hair? Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Richard might not be right for our treatment. Tell me, why do you want hair? I think I'll feel better about myself. There are certain advantages to being bald, Richard. For instance, bald men are often considered to be more trustworthy, less threatening. The primal power that a full head of hair bestows on a man brings a certain pressure to perform. Uh, some men realize that they prefer to remain out of the limelight. Well, that may be so, Doctor, but I want hair. I want lots of hair. You don't think I'm up to it, do you? Are you? I think so. I think so, too. It'll change your life, Richard. I want it to change. You sure? I'm positive. I love a positive man. Very well. Nurse, activate the confiscant. Now, I'll uh, just insert your picture into the graphic scanner. And voila. Now, we uh, have uh, quite a few hair personalities for you to choose from, uh, depending on which trait you wish to emphasize. This is your basic conservative look. We call it traditional Republican. I don't know. Uh... I agree. No? Well, uh, go a little bit more daring. The military style? Favored by police, soldiers, athletes? I don't know. It's almost too... Uh, it's Drab. Too... Exactly. You see, I want something that is very um, exciting. Yes. Bold. Yes. Sexy. Yes, yes! Let's try this. We call this our stallion look. <gasps> Giddy up. Yes, that's... It. That's the one. The stallion look it is. Congratulations, Richard. Uh, no surgery. No, oh, no, no. Heavens, no, no. We apply the solution here. Then uh, when you wake up tomorrow morning in your own bed, you take off the bandage and you're a new man. Please let me have hair. If I have hair, I have everything. I just want to love me again. I don't love me the way I am now. I love me the way 
I used to be, the way I want to be. Please, God, just let me have it. Let you touch it, I'll have to let everybody else touch it. <laughs> yes, yes, it is the source of all my strength. But it's not the only source. See that my men are well fed. And bring forth the women. It's incredible. Who is this Dr. Locke? He advertises on TV. Why doesn't everybody go to him? He's new. It's amazing. I can't believe what it's done for you. Oh. Mm. 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 You even kiss better. Oh. I know I said it didn't matter, but you look so fantastic. With this new hair, you're just so, you're so, you're so animal. <sighs> Tell me you love me, Richard. Just me. Maybe we overdid it last night, huh? Oh, I got this tickle on my throat. Well, I'd love to stay and scratch you, but I gotta go. Oh. See you later, sexy. <laughs> Take care of that sore throat, you hear? Mm -hmm. You gotta save all your strength for me. Mm And it's not a weave. No, oh, no, it's all mine, baby. Oh, man, it seems so good and healthy, you know? <laughs> oh, man, all right, okay. Who is this Dr. Locke, huh? He's new. You look great. I know. You look great. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to cut it a little bit, okay? <coughs> just give it a little bit of shape. You all right, buddy? Not too much. Not too oh, no, much. no, 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 no. Yes, style. Yes. Style. Hello. Lousy. 
I don't know. I just don't feel too good. Huh? I'm getting a haircut. Yeah, well, after you left this morning, I discovered that my hair's grown nearly six inches. No, I'm not kidding. I know, it's weird. Listen, I'm glad you called. Um, I'm gonna have to cancel our date tonight. I really think I'm coming down with something. No, I am not seeing somebody else. Come on, Megan, what's the matter with you? Okay. Yeah, yeah. That's all right. Yeah. Thanks. is here. Why don't you believe me? I told you I'm sick. <laughs> it's not an act. What? Oh, fine. Suit yourself. Don't believe me then. Happy darling. Of course. Ah, Richard, how are you? Guess. You look great. Another successful operation. What are you talking about? Look what's happening to me. I know, isn't it wonderful? <gasps> Let me show you something. <gasps> you earthlings and your vanity. You're so predictably easy. 
You know, at first it was difficult. When we arrived on this planet, we were tiny, starving organisms. And then we discovered that your brains are the only food on which we can thrive. But the question was one of access. We seem to have found the answer. In fact, we're particularly enjoying your brain. We like fat. Nurse, transfer Richard into implant containers, then call in the next patient. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. 